Are you encountering issues with your map and trees loading far off in the distance and it's not really rendering until you're right up on top of it? I was having the same issue. Here's how I fixed it. So first thing we want to check is go to start and type in Xbox networking. We want to check the networking connection to Xbox servers and it's already running a test when you first open it. So we're going to see what we get. So this is the main thing here. We had our latency is only 120 milliseconds. It's not terrible. No packet loss. But the issue we have is we are having a blocked server connection. We're going to go ahead and click fix it. And then we're going to run check again once this completes. And still blocked. This is kind of crazy, but this is what I found to work. Go ahead and click start again, leaving your Xbox networking window up. Type in Defender. So we want to go to Windows Defender Firewall. And being an IT guy, I've always disabled this, but we want to go over here to turn Windows Defender Firewall on or off. And I want to go ahead and add that I have not messed with any of the advanced settings or ports with the firewall. This is just basic out of the box for any typical Windows user who might own a computer. So we're going to turn on both for private and public networks and hit OK. Now we see that they're on. Go ahead and close this. We're going to go ahead and fix it again. And we're going to check again. Oh, let's fix it one more time. We're still blocked. And boom. We are connected to the Microsoft servers. We should be uh, downloading the map data that we need now. Let's go ahead and jump into Sim and check a few game settings before we test it. All right, once you're in the Sim, go ahead to Options and General. So here in the graphics, we just want to make sure that we have these things on Ultra, depending on your graphics card, of course. I mean, high still good. High still going to give you a really good picture. You just want to make sure that you're at least at 100 on terrain of level of detail and at least for testing purposes, turn these up to higher ultra just to make sure that things are rendering. If it's causing some lag and you're flying and FPS drops, put these somewhere where they're going to be comparable for your graphics card. And then next, this is very important, go to your data and make sure that you have data limitation off, your bandwidth set to unlimited, and uh, make sure that you've got everything up here should be on but at least have online functionality, being data world graphics, photogrammetry. Those three things are very important. And then jump in the sim and you should see a noticeable difference in the distance at which your trees and the map is actually loading. Well, I hope that this was helpful to some people in resolving their map and tree loading issues. Until next time, take care.